Hello everyone, welcome to IEEE Expert. Today we are going to see project about identifying fake product using blockchain technology. So in current world, everyone making counterfeit product. Counterfeit products means fake products. Using their own mechanism, using their own algorithm, they are making you, they, using their own missionaries, they are making counterfeit product. That is a, a duplicate product. It's not belongs to original category. They are making first copy, second copy like that. They are making duplicate copy. So everyone know China making all the duplicate products, uh, first copy products, and imported into various countries. So in this project, we are going to implement a mechanism, completely novel mechanism, using the blockchain technology. Based on the blockchain technology, we are going to implement a mechanism that is used to identify the counterfeit products that means fake products so this is most helpful in overall supply chain management system overall supply chain management means selling and buying system so here what we are going to do means you have to generate unique qr code for each and every product from the manufacturer side so those qr codes can't be duplicated cannot be remaked okay cannot be duplicated so using that qr code we have to analyze whether the product is authentic or uh, duplicate like that so before going to that uh, project we are iwexpert.com we are providing complete machine learning software projects at low cost if you need any own requirement means just contact us for the project support so this is the overall uh, aim of the project this project published on the june 2022 this is completely new project so this is the overall architecture of the project so you are seeing that manufacturer going to login using that login he can add the product based on that product it will generate the qr code so this is from seller side he can login he can register with the multiple product as well as he can verify the transactions also so this is the overall architecture uh, i'm going to explain the ppt for this project so this is the ppt of the project fake product identification system using blockchain technology this is the abstract here i mentioned that various companies are affecting by the fake products they are sale their uh, margin everything eaten up by the fake products not only seller affecting as uh, from the buyer's perspective we are also affecting we are leased to buy the duplicate products with the same price of original products so you everyone doing in e-commerce sites e-commerce purchase you know we don't know whether we are using original product or duplicate product so this project will be helpful for the particular time okay that time of purchase this product or this project will be most helpful also we are using completely blockchain technology it can't be duplicated it can't be modifiable also blockchain means complex process you know so for making blockchain easier we are interfacing qr code with this Using that QR code scanning itself, you may get to uh, get the idea about the project, whether that is fake or original like that. So this is the overall introduction of the project. As well as the main main problem was the manufacturer, as well as brand by yes, we are operating by the fake products. So fake products are selling by the cheaper rates as well as higher rate. We don't know whether this is fake or original. But distinction between original product or fake product, we are going for this project. So this is the overall solution. We are going to generate a brand new QR code technology using the blockchain. So blockchain by using blockchain, we are generating QR code. By using that QR code, you can verify that is original or uh, fake product. Also here, more advantage was the, that QR code cannot be modifiable, cannot be regeneratable. So only one time it can be used for the manufacturer. No one can make the duplicate copy of the QR code. That is the main advantage of the project. So this is the overall solution, our solution. Everything mentioned, as I mentioned here, manufacturing man 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 how to add the product, as well it can generate the QR code. From the user side, we have to register and we have to scan the QR code based on that blockchain mechanism. It will show whether that is fake or authentic, authentic product like that. So this is the implementation. Here we are using blockchain mechanism, as code generation for the QR code purpose. This is the system requirement. We are using Python for this conclusion of the project as well as reference of the project so before wasting your time directly i'm going to run the project for this project report also available so just i'm going to run the project for you so for that i'm using python software for running the project cd space then link i'm going to run the project using python space main.py this is my mail id so if i'm generating here means it will generate my project website address just i'm copying the project website address and putting over here so this is the project home page okay 
here you, as a admin you can add ma many products over here for example i am adding uh, fertilizer for your uh, wine i am adding wine so this is my things the wine name was i don't know wine names and all i am giving some random name as a wine world as a brand name as well as wine name was wine prime i am giving name as a wine prime wine prime this is the wine name so this batch was uh, 2023 12 batch number so batch id was 110 110 just i'm giving batch number so then then i'm forwarding the batch manufacturing date this is the manufacturing date the overall cost of the wine was i'm giving as a 5000 rupees so batch in this batch i manufacture only one wine so this type was wine i'm giving type as a wine so this is the project addition so i'm going to submit the project details you can see product added successfully to the blockchain if you're going to the command terminal means you can see this is the data manufacturer product details everything everything so all the hash see that wine world wine prime data and one wine this is the hash code for the particular wine this is the hash code for the particular wine if i'm going to the project then you are going for the qr means you can see this is the wine prime you may see the details then what i'm going to do means i'm going to add one more product for you uh, just i'm using uh, medicine i'm adding some medicine over here so medicine i'm using um, what i means anasin anasin as a so not sun pharma brand name was sun pharma i'm giving sun pharma name was dolo 650 tablets i'm adding dolo 650 batch was uh, 12 10 then id was 10112 i'm giving then manufacturing date i'm going to give so this manufacturer on uh, 2 1 2023 it is expired on example i'm giving example as a 31 1 2023 it's expiring its price was just 400 rupees i'm giving price was nearly 20 tablets available this type was medicine medicine i'm giving as a medicine then i'm going to give summit See that product add successfully then if i'm going for the common prompt means you can see complete details of the product just a minute so you can see sun pharma dollar 650 batch name all the hash codes are generated if you're going for the qr code also if you're going for the qr code means you can see dollar 650 qr code like that you can generate multiple qr code with this also in database all the data are entered i'm going for the n4 database here you can find you can find blockchain database here here you can see various data this is the manufacturer sun pharma dollar 650 batch size product id all the hash codes everything mentioned here see that manufacturer wine world product wine frame hash code everything stored here whatever products you are entering you, those product details are entered here saved here automatically various database we are using here so then you can add product from the uh, manufacturer side also for example i'm giving seller side also you can use product registration just i'm logging with the python space main just i'm logging with the python space main dot py For adding product from the seller side, what we are going to do means we have to run as a python index.py. We have to run use python index.py. Then we have to give our login credential. This is from seller side. This is from seller side means we have to give seller credential. So you can find the seller credential here. So this is the seller credential. For example, I am using Dr. Reddy as my seller credential. That means Dr. Reddy was medicine seller i am giving password as a password 123 this is my seller side use usage here you can use seller side usage also so then you have to add the item then you have to give enter then what is the product brand you have to use means i am using uh, what i am using means pharma lab i am using pharma lab then product name was anasin i am using then product batch was 2020 product manufacturing date was 1 1 
2023 I am given. Then product expiry date was uh, then 25 12, 26 I am giving uh, expiry date. Then product ID was 1012. Then product price was 600 I am giving. Then product batch size was 20 tablets there I am giving 20. Product type was medicine. Just enter. You can see the details also. Then you can find out the hash data also. Like that, you can add multiple products. So this is the hash value of the particular product. You can find the QR code also inside the QR code tab. So you can find the QR code Anasi. So this is the QR code. So here I generated various QR codes. What what I'm going to do for the verification means directly you can scan the QR code. You have to verify the results. For that, what I'm using means directly you can uh, scan with the mobile, uh, directly you can scan with the uh, website, uh, laptop also. I'm just using QR code here, QR code scanner. Just I'm using QR code scanner here. What I'm going to use means I'm just going to upload my QR code. For example, I'm uploading the Dolo, Dolo 650 QR code. So this is the Dolo 650 QR code. Just it will give one link. You have to click the link over here. If you're clicking links means Hold on for a second. If you are clicking the link means directly to scan and give the results. Again, I am scanning here. So I am going to QR code scanner. You can use mobile also. Just I am scanning dollar 650 here. So this is the dollar 650 hash value. Just I am clicking this hash value. It will come over here. So this is the dollar 650 hash value. You can find the complete hash value of the dollar 650. Just you have to this is not the same hash which is stored on the database. It will generate the encrypted hash. So no one able to modify here. Just click the verify. See that this product was authentic. It's manufactured by Sun Pharma. Name of dollar six fifty. Batch size, ID size, manufacturing date, price, medicine. Everything mentioned here. You can upload very other other QR code also. You can verify. For example, I am uploading one more uh, something here. For example, I am uploading this wine which I added earlier. So this is the wine. This is the hash value for the wine. If I'm clicking here means, so this is the wine things. If I'm clicking means, see that manufactured by Wine World, Wine Prime, as well as the batch size, ID, overall rate, size, everything mentioned here. What if I'm uploading the duplicate uh, uh, QR code means? See that that result also. I made some duplicate QR code for this project itself. You can upload any duplicate QR code, not an issue. It will give the results. For example, I'm uploading here. This is the duplicate QR code with a duplicate hash I uploaded. Just I'm clicking means it will give the results here. See that this is the duplicate product QR code. If I'm verifying means you see verification fail. So it won't work out here. That is the main advantage. Here. So in a, for your uh, assumption, I'm uploading one more uh, data also here. So I'm uploading one more fake product QR code here. For example, this one I'm uploading. So this is the fake QR code. I am uploaded fake uh, QR, fake hash value here. Just I am clicking here means it will give the hash value. Just a verification means see that verification fail. So it won't work out here. So this is the major advantage. If you are uploading the original product, means surely it will give the results. Example, I am uploading one more data here. I am uploading some more one more product for your references. Uh, this Anasin I uploaded now. Just I am clicking that links Anasin. Just verification means you can see pharma lab announcing manufacturing rate everything mentioned here so this is the overall advantage of the project you can see the verification tab also here all the data are completely verified in the back so this is the project if you need this project means you need to purchase this project means please contact ieexpert.com we are giving this project at the best price thank you thank you for your time please subscribe and support us